while I was scrolling through Twitch and Steam, I noticed that the sequel to Only Up is out. And when I say the sequel to Only Up, I, I mean that very literally. Because there's been a lot of spiritual successors to Only Up. I think I made a video on my channel actually called Only Up 2. This one, however, is made by the devs of Only Up. And uh, people fucking hate it. <laughs> Dude, I haven't played it. I will hold my uh, opinion until I play it. But, oof, they don't love it. Only Up 2, the official. And the reviews are in. Negative. <laughs> really disappointing. Don't buy waste of time. I don't know what this means, but I bet it's hurtful. Here's what we're going to do today. Here's my game plan. The game came out. I have put myself in a position in this world as a creator where my niche is playing these games. But because this one is rated so poorly, I have an additional goal. Now, if you don't know, Steam has actually a, a bit of a, a fun little rule. If you only play a Steam game for two hours or less, you're able to refund the game. <laughs> so today, my dream is a refund speed run. I want to beat this game in two hours and then refund it because if it's as dog shit as people say, I don't want to support the company who made it. It's not even the same dev? Is it not? If you take a look over what games are coming to Steam this month, you might be surprised to see that a sequel to the short-lived viral hit Only Up is fast approaching. However, it's not as it seems. This new game arriving on Steam December 18th, titled Only Up 2, looks like a carbon copy of the original, which itself is a phase of accusations of plagiarism, and sporting a new name, which makes it sound like a direct follow-up. But it has nothing to do with the developer of the first game. I'd say it's a clear attempt at making a clone to ride on the success of the original. We couldn't find more info. And I fucking bought it? All the better for my game plan. Beat the game in less than two hours. Get the content from it. Get paid for that. Refund it. Get all my money back. Uh-oh, dev. It seems like I'm the one who's won this interaction. Wait. Do you think this is okay? Guys. Oh, this is going to be a shit show. This is going to be a shit show. All right. We're starting in the favelas. Same old, same old. Part of what gave Only Up its charm was the seemingly AI written, translated through seven languages voice over and the music. So I hope they still have that. Okay. Yep. And they don't even have a song when you hit the bottom? Dude, why do I feel like my computer's about to explode? I just need to get to the top before I mine them a whole ass Bitcoin. To, to not be a hater for a second, it does move very similar, right? Like, I don't feel like I'm playing a different game. I feel like I'm playing only up on a different map. If they don't have a big-ass dragon at the end, this was definitely a scam. Okay, we got fucking trains, finally. <gasps> Just out of curiosity, what happens if I let you crush my bones? Right. Yeah, that makes sense. Ooh, it's like Frogger. Okay. That, hey, that was kind of fun. Little dopamine hit for that right there. Do you cater to Kindle Fire viewers? <laughs> yeah. If you actually get a membership, it's a buy one, get one. Uh, uh. No! Oh, thank God. They have copyright free music. Why would anyone ma waste money on a membership? Uh, that's a dollar. That's the reality. It's a dollar a month. You gotta remember, money at the end of the day is just a, it's a, it's a tool. It's a utility tool that gets you stuff. Some stuff that you need, some stuff that makes you want to fucking die inside slowly, by, bit by bit, inch by inch. Oh. Like, I chose to spend $7 on this game. I chose to use that money on this game. To be fair, it doesn't even crack the top five worst expenditures I've had this week. Oh, a little bed jump for the folks? What the fuck is this bed? Why is it big as shit? Is this truck gonna just drive me? What What are we doing here? Oh. <laughs> no, the tire drives you. Okay. <laughs> Perfectly good truck. Okay. All right. Fair enough. Sometimes it's hard to choose the right path, but don't be afraid. You can always repeat. We learn from our mistakes. That's what this game's missing right now, is some inspirational voiceover. Oh, that's a skinny little pipe. That's what she said. Really, chat? That's what she said? What's the circumstance? You're pulling down your pants, and then she goes, that's a skinny little pipe? <laughs> like, that'd be an absurd thing to say. Although one time, when I was hooking up with a girl in college, she put her hand on my pants and then said, ew, it feels like a worm. 
that's probably more hurtful. So, you know what? Maybe you're right. Ah! No! No! Fuck you, man. Wait. Oh, fuck. Yeah, that's great. No, that's a really good jump. The FBI and CIA combined could not get that worm story out of me. The worst part is, I said, wait till you feel it's soft. All right, let's just focus, okay? Sometimes it's hard to choose the right path, but don't be afraid. You can always repeat. We learn from our mistakes. Okay. All right, okay, cool. So far, so good. Gone through all the pipes. Now we've hit a record store. This is honestly looking like me and Doug Doug's only up map. <laughs> Just parts of a store somewhat haphazardly strewn around. Still at pipes, squeaks. <laughs> is he actually not verified? He's not ver- Oh, wait, oh. He's not verified on YouTube. Because to get verified, you need 100,000 subscribers. He's at 93. And so now I'm, I'm sub-shaming. And that's not what I meant to do. I was actually just... I thought it was a fake account. I actually thought it was a fake account. I, I dead ass. Well, I'm, I'm still being hurt. I should just stop talking. Shout out Squeaks, whose Paramount Plus account I have been using for the past three months to watch Survivor. I'm changing the password. Don't change the password to the freaking account, dude. It's literally the finale this week, man. Do I trust this bed? Yeah, why not? Cool. <laughs> really dope. My fiance and I watch your videos together every night. Now our four month baby likes you too. Thanks for all the joy you bring to our family. I'm not even joking. I have talked about this for years. You can probably go back four years and find a clip of me saying that my dream is that everybody in my chat finds a significant other, a wife, husband, whatever. They get married, they have their kids, then they show their kids my channel. And I live forever in eternity, generation by generation. Like an old family heirloom that you just have to pass on. And the only reason you have to is because it's been around so long. Not even because you like it anymore. No shot, I'm telling my kid about you, Lamau. <laughs> okay. I would tell my kid about you. I'd be like, yeah, there's this viewer. He'd hurt my feelings every stream. He'd change my life. What is this? Go back down to the favela. <laughs> is that a southern sheep? Go back down to the favela. I showed my kids a stream. They said, we don't watch boomers, LOL. Okay. Skibbity, 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 skibbity. Are they in? Do they like that? So you think you can beat this game in an hour? Well, I'll make sure that you don't with this curse. Testicles, testicles, testicles. Testicles, 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 testicles. Stop! Testicles. Stop! It's stressful. Damn, there's still a lot left to go. I feel like I'm killing it, though. I haven't, I shouldn't say the rest of the sentence. It's actually really dumb to say out loud. I haven't taken a spill in a while. <sighs> Fuck, I needed to get it out. Wait, wait, wait. Stop. Everybody stop. Stop. This is a Twicky puzzle. This is tricky because I don't think this jump is achievable by me. I don't think this jump is achievable by man. This one's for women. Glass ceiling finally broken. So true. All it took was a man. <laughs> that's, that's actually, I, I can't break the glass ceiling. Do you see why I'd be wrong if I broke it? This is what it's like to not jerk off for one day. You you reach this level of enlightenment. Ooh, that's a skinny pipe. Look at me. Look at me freak on this shit. Nobody freaks on this shit like I do. I'm doing tricks on it. All right, hold up. Let's go to let's go to the Padoga. Pagoda. Ah! Yay. Ludwig, can you please pause the stream? I need to pee kind of doing like a thing here the timer's still going sorry no i can't all right let's look up let's see where we're going where this bed might take us nice this game so far has no story i will say it's very bland the last game was this beautiful story about this uh, 
abused girl in the favelas who had to climb out despite being told by many animals that she could not do it and that she was destined to return home. And she finally conquered it by climbing a dragon. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't get that part. <laughs> Dude, what? That's it? That's the whole game. <laughs> oh, what a horrible game. It definitely could not be made by the same dev. Just to follow through on what I said I would do, let me see if I'm able to refund. We did it! This game is a huge scam. Definitely don't buy it. Although it's called Only Up 2, they just ripped off the idea of the dev who ripped off a bunch of assets, who ripped off Bennett Foddy. So it's an Ouroboros. Better yet, it's a human centipede of shit. Let's call it Mission Success. I played it for y'all in hour 11. That's crazy. That game was, that game was bad.